what are some common reactions we usually get to see from students after appearing in exams? Oh, I misread this question. I forgot to add this sentence. I accidentally ticked B instead of C. But what about instead of getting nervous, we start making proper preparations to it. So in today's session, we'll be discussing all the important tips to avoid some common mistakes in 12th board and tips to score well in tough chapters. So let's get started. So let's begin the first session. Important tips to avoid some common mistakes in 12 boards. Tip 1. Always keep on working on yourself to do better. Always remember, you are your own competitor. You always strive to do better than the previous attempt. Let's say you appeared in an exam and you secured 50%. Try to secure 60% in your next attempt. This process will not only help you in evaluating the areas where you require improvement, but also boost your scores. Always aim for the higher scores. Tip 2. Maintain a positive attitude. Maintaining a positive attitude is extremely important not only during exam, but throughout your life. Having a positive attitude will always keep your mind at ease. Tip 3. Stick to the main syllabus. There are various books available in the market and sometimes it can be really confusing for a student which source to rely on. My advice to you here is always stick to the main syllabus. Most students who clear their test with flying colors refer to the main syllabus. I'm not saying reference books are not good, but you should always use them as an alternative only after completing your main syllabus. Tip 4. Time management. Make your own schedule or timetable that you must follow daily. Each subject should be given equal time so that all subjects are covered. Make sure that you're giving 4 to 5 hours daily to your self-studies. In this way, you'll be able to manage your time most effectively. Tip 5. Solve previous year question papers. When it comes to 12 board exams, previous year question papers are extremely important as it gives you the real simulation of exam. While solving the paper, imagine that you're sitting in the examination hall as this practice will help you to do better. And lastly, most important tip, tip 6. Take care of your health. It is needless to say that exam times are highly stressful and it is extremely important for you to take proper care of your health. Eat properly, take proper rest, indulge in activities that keep your mind relaxed. Now let's start the second segment of the series, tips to score good marks in tough chapters. Tip 1. Stick to the main NCRT. In order to ace your board exams, cover all the topics, solve examples and questions of NCRT. Do not forget to also mark important and difficult questions while practicing. Start from the chapters that carry maximum weightage under different sections. Tip 2. Writing skills are very important. Do you want to know the perks of getting good marks in your exams? While writing long and descriptive answers, try to present them in points followed by a neat and label diagram. Neat work is a non-negotiable perk that will always benefit a student. This will make your answers stand out from the rest. Tip 3. Focus on numerical problems. Time is very crucial in any exam. While attempting a descriptive question, we must understand that it may take up a lot of time and may also not ensure full marks at the end of it. Therefore, it is always advisable to practice as many numerical problems as possible. Tip 4. Self-evaluation. The anxiety that builds up while preparing for an examination is an inevitable part of the process. It is very natural to feel frustrated over your lack of preparation. Evaluate yourself by identifying your weak areas so that you can work on them instead of feeling sorry for yourself. Tip 5. Say no to distraction. You have an important exam to clear and you cannot afford to miss out on any subject. In this crucial time, stay away from all the distractions that may hamper your study regime. We have almost come to the end of today's session. Before we wind up, make sure you like and subscribe to Extra Marks J YouTube channel for more such content. Also, like the video and comment down below and tell us what topic you want us to cover next. Until then, see you. Good luck.